Greetings, Cagelings. Cage Prime here with my live reaction of One Punch Man, Chapter 198. Or, no, it's 200. Okay. Uh, magazines. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, we'll go with Marana. Anyway, 200. So there's the rock throwing dude. Stupid ninja. Cough, why didn't you kill me? You could easily cut my head off. As if. As they say, even the smallest of insects have hot souls. I figured I'd at least let you hear the real truth about the village before you die. Eh? Sonic seems to be somewhat intrigued and unknowing of this truth. Huh? God? You say? Yes. We believe the village was a testing ground for creating minions of God similar to that man. From a young age, taking away their humanity, torturing them with training to their very limits. Sonic, you saw what I saw underground too, right? The cube was being used to test people's uh, suitability as minions of God. Okay, that would definitely make more sense. Also, there's like literally just a pile of bones and dust. <laughs> if you were not suitable, your life is forfeit. The image of the village being a training facility for assassins that was just a facade so it was all a lie did he actually come to this conclusion or is this what it actually was I would assume so in other words all of you wait what okay the village was being handled by someone other than that man so it's possible that it eventually became that like, they made contact with God from, like, it was being contained there. You know, it was a safeguard. Maybe that was one of the first that they had captured, you know, him and Blast. So then, like, they used the Ninja Village as, like, a, a testing ground for safeguarding it. So people were trained and whatnot. But then, you know, he monstrified, decided to seal himself away or Blast did I forget if Blast was actually the reason for that but either way, so he's locked away someone else takes over the village makes contact with God and then it's like hmm, time for a little reorganization <laughs> but, back to the story uh, in other words all you were safely shipped out as assassins from that man's perspective you were not elite but instead utter failures heavenly ninjas what foolishness getting sucked into going along with the ride doesn't accomplish anything you had your entire lives stolen from you and you still don't get it is that all true if you don't believe me just find blast and ask him he's around for a change <laughs> so some of them are laughing why are they laughing our lives stolen, you say. How presumptuous. Why do you assume that they weren't offered? Oh my god. Have you grown dissatisfied with the illusion of living your own life, which you selfishly harbored in defiance of the village teachings? I still can't understand how dropouts think. They're replacing book marker with dropout. It's less accurate, but the former was causing confusion. Okay. Are they about to merge into a being? Only, uh, know that only in fulfilling the duties given to us can we ninja find our final resting place. It doesn't matter who the, ma who the master we serve is, we must give our lives for them. Listen, vermin who have forgotten the sworn duty of a ninja, we... The Heavenly Ninjas are blessed. That was the title, so they've been blessed with actual power. They're about to monsterify. Also, uh, we got some crows flying in. One of them looks like a Tengu. <laughs> I see, like, little legs. Hehe, <laughs> blessed, blessed, B blessed. That's right, blessed. Okay, come up with something else. They're beyond help. Guess I'll kill them. <laughs> Damn robots. Wait, are they ro- What? 
oh god, they are convulsing just like uh, a show I've been watching called, um, crap, what was it called? Uh, we Are All Dead. I think. But, uh, it's a Korean production. It's pretty good. Uh, what the? It's that man. That man is finally arriving. What? <laughs> no doubt. You, you'll soon realize that getting killed by us would have been much more pleasant. By consuming human blood and organs, that man has been truly born anew. That He's been eating blood and organs. Okay. There is no future for any of you. But, oh, master. If it is our blood and entrails that you desire. And he's inflating and gushing blood. Okay. Why does this look like telekinesis? They're horrified by this. They're all, all their physical mass is essentially being broken down and turned into a whirlwind of flesh and meat. Oh my god, is he like teleporting via them? Oh my god, he's actually eating them. He showed up. He's out of the tank. He's there. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> like, I expected maybe something else. Like, maybe that this was the, some kind of joint monstrification form. And that what they were saying was a total lie. I mean, this may not even be that man. I mean, he kind of looks like him, but, you know, misdirects and whatnot. And plus, they're fucking ninjas. You don't think body doubles or someone trying to take, you know, um, what is it called? It's like what, like false valor kind of deal don't exist so yeah I, I'm, I'm skeptical if it actually is him or not we'll have to wait and see of course I mean he just kind of appeared and then he consumed all of their fleshy goodness and drank it down with a good helping of double O negative uh, but yes hmm. double O negative is not a blood type you idiot um, but anyway <laughs> They're all just double O's now because they's dead. Um, God. F in for the chat, I guess, for a bunch of ninjas that we didn't really care for. But, oh well. Um, don't really have much to say about this that I haven't already said before. I, my big theory is, I think, the biggest commentary I can give on this video. So, um, yeah. Let me know your own thoughts and opinions, anything I missed, misunderstood. Please let me know down below. Check out my other content, see what you like, suggest things for the future. Um, links down below for all my social media so you can keep up my content, have ways contact me. I stream here on YouTube where I do long-form reactions, gameplay, random stuff. Suggestions always welcome. Part of the One Punch Man podcast on Grim Reaper's channel, so go check that out. We'll probably be doing this next week, I imagine. If not Friday, but we'll see. Um, and uh, yeah, as always, later days. Until next time, Keechlings. Watch out for that man or that man. I don't know if it's really him. <laughs>